the land of frost. Everything was frozen in Shushire through the power of Sirius, a prison of ice to bind the accursed flame demons. But cracks had started to form in the ice. Lord Sirius bade us to find the Frost Warrior to battle the returning demons. We found you, the hero of the arena. You proved your worth in that Colosseum of pain and death. Only you had the power to save Shushire from chaos. Awakened, the demons called forth the dead to bolster their forces. They had to be stopped. I've planned my revenge for a thousand years, only to be destroyed by this little... You exceeded our every expectation. But our world is facing an even greater peril. Follow the path of light. Use your strength to drive out the darkness from this world. O oh, light upon the frozen soil. The spring bloom admits the bitter cold. You were once the joy of a whole kingdom. And then the last hope for a crumbling realm. But to you, these expectations felt like shackles, your duty a prison. For the king would do nothing but obsess over past glories. And cling desperately to his fading throne. I shall restore the royal family's honor! Despite being cursed with his single useless offspring, Shushire is mine! Forever mine! The king did everything in his power to leave you helpless. However, fate had far grander plans for you than just being a royal princess of a fallen kingdom. On the day the demonic forces invaded, My way, Arius! I will not die in here with you fools! The king abandoned his people and fled to safety. But you chose to stay and fight with your knights. To save the kingdom that had forsaken you. You answered the call of destiny. The spirit of frost is with you. Raise your sword. And break free of that which binds you. With the sword of Sirius in your hand, you defeated the demons and saved your people. You declared an end to your family's rule and then left through the Radiant Path. Go with honor, you who have been chosen by fate. Though you are no longer our princess, you are still our leader. And so now, 
We wait in confident silence. We wait for the day that the savior of Arcasia returns to her people. So you want to hear a story about a martial artist? <laughs> and I assume you're tired of hearing about the Grandmaster, right? Okay, here's a good one. Once upon a time in Annika, there was a mediocre martial artist. Truly unremarkable. But, one day, demons attacked his clan's compound. His brother died, saving him from the demon leader's attack. And only he was spared because he wasn't considered a threat. That day, vengeance consumed his heart. He devoted his life to training, day and night, always improving, getting ready. And one day, the demon fiend and its minions came back. And he faced them on his own. He fought like a man possessed. And unlike the first battle, none of the foul creatures were spared. And that's the end of his story. <laughs> or perhaps he heard the call of a new challenge out in the world. Plenty of innocents to protect, and plenty of demons to kill. Annika, the land of many martial artists. But only those who pass the Guardian's tests can call themselves a Grand Master. The Grand Master trial begins now. Represent your house and prove your worth. Sounds lame. With my powers, you'll become the Grand Master in no time. I demand a redo! I'll show you! <laughs> now, conquer the Guardians with my overwhelming desire. Your competition, Hoden, fell for the demon's tricks. He made a mockery of the sacred trial and angered the Guardians. There is no shortcut to power. It is achieved through hard work and discipline. Qualities you demonstrated in abundance. You proved yourself worthy of the title Grand Master. My daughter. You are now champion of the Guardians. Be their light that pierces through the darkness. The real trial begins now. Destiny calls for you. It was a tough mission. Even for an Arthateen specialist like yourself. Dr. Bergstrom was using innocent people in his ghastly experiments. 
What could drive Arthur the team's most respected scientist to do such a thing? It was that damn gem. The ruby eye, they call it. That was no gem. It was the eye of a particularly nasty demon. The ruby eye had the power to control minds. Our best specialists fell prey to its powers. It took Yorn. And me. Take the ruby eye! <laughs> but you were different. You overcame the temptations of the ruby eye and fought the demons trying to resurrect Akan. You're gonna need that strength of will for the next mission. How dare. Good luck, partner. And when you save the world, drinks are on me. Arthetine. A cold land of cold machines. We Psykins are always chasing the next big thing. Dr. Bergstrom? I am nothing like him. I'm better than him, beyond him. To be Psykin is to evolve, after all. I'll make you regret choosing Stern over me, Gunslinger. <laughs> but you were in the laboratory. Can't you see? You're in the way of progress. No matter. Time to shed this useless body the gods cursed me with. Behold, true evolution! <laughs> that gun of yours doesn't have enough bullets for all of us specialists. No one can stop Kaiserin. You think you have some great destiny? Well, I'll be watching. <gasps> In Roendel, the land of magic, all Sylvains who come of age receive the spirit and power of an ancestor. In a great ceremony. Your coming of age ceremony was special. I, Archmage Visca, chose you to receive my soul. But the demons came and spoiled our moment. Relshaza, commander of the Phantom Legion, stole my soul and used its power to try and destroy Rowendell. Brailshaza! Queen Azina battled the demon to a stalemate. Brailshaza fled to plot her next move. But her army invaded Roendel. But you never gave up. You stood up to the demons, defended Rowendell, and won back my soul. You are the one I've been searching for. The one who never surrenders, even in the face of oblivion. The one who can face our enemies with true courage. I, I lost to a servant! No! 
destiny calls. Embrace the light. Listen up. We are the Delanes, the ones born of chaos. We are the Avesta, protectors of Phaeton, our home. We walk the line between control and oblivion. We get the missions the others can't handle. We handle the traitors. It's eat or be eaten in this cruel world. <laughs> Listen to the voice. The voice is calling me. Your last mission was a success. You face down the darkness living within you. But you never backed down. You overcame your inner darkness and protected your true self. Which means it's time for a new mission. Avesta, head toward the light. And find the strength to protect a world that hates you. The land that defends the dawn, Remiria. After a coming-of-age ceremony, the Yaws use our power to commune with nature to refine various skills. Protecting this land is the duty of every Yaws. One day, the dark energy began to threaten our world. And the seal over Remiria was finally destroyed. <laughs> How dare the fallen step foot on the land of the living! Young Yaz. Do you know what lies beyond your borders? Beyond the Dark Curtain, where even darkness fears? Do you know what it is that you have sealed up in there? The energy that flowed in through the door of Nar shattered reality. And it brought the dark of night to this land once more. But your noble heart was not easily shaken. No. I can't go back to that cold, lonely place. But you will soon find out how our world is changing. The darkness that shrouded Remiria disappeared. But we still must wait for the light to return to this world once again.